Thor himself, Chris Hemsworth, recently talked a little bit about making a cameo in Deadpool and Wolverine, and a cameo that he wasn't even really aware of, and now people believe there's more to this cameo role than meets the eye. So this cameo comes at us from Thor The Dark World, and essentially in that film, there is multiple scenes that didn't make it in and or were on the cutting room floor for whatever reason. Well, there is a scene in the TVA where we're seeing clips from the MCU or things that go differently. One of them happens to be Loki replaced with Deadpool as Chris Hemsworth is holding his body. Well, as it turns out, this is one of the uh, ways that they were able to work in a alternative cameo without actually using the actor, right? Without paying Chris Hemsworth to be back, they have archive footage and other footage that's on the cutting room floor that they can use however. And Chris Hemsworth said that it was kind of really cool to see this, that there's a way to get him into this film but also change the context of it, use it in a different way, reshape it, and to tell the story that they need to tell. So he says he's really excited about seeing the film, how it all plays out, and what they do. Now, on top of this, now there's rumors that Chris Hemsworth will appear as Thor and that he's just sort of deflecting with this, which, you know, realistically could happen. I mean, who's to say we're not going to see a version of Thor in the void that's like a variant because remember, all the Lokis were there. There was also a Thor variant there. Like, it's very possible. We don't know. We we literally don't know. We just know that recently they shot a whole bunch of new cameos. So, maybe. I mean, anything is possible. They could also ask him for permission and literally just drop a CG version of him in there. Because they got it. So, whatever happens, happens. I'm excited. If he's in it, cool. If he's not, and it's archive footage, but changed. And it shows us what could happen, and it's part of the multiverse and the bigger, hey, look at all these permutations of the sacred timeline. That's cool as well. It just adds a little more in there. 